Well, good afternoon, everybody. I'm George Latimer, Westchester County Executive, and we're very delighted to have you here, the young people and their parents and anyone who is uh, involved in the various school districts. Uh, I am told that this is the <clears throat> most significant collection of people and intellect in this room at any point in time. <laughs> and, and since I got gentlemanly C's in chemistry and biology and physics, I am <laughs> the least uh, able to handle myself in a room full of people who achieved at the level of science in high school. So we're very happy to have you here with us. Um, my understanding is, is that uh, those who we're honoring today have uh, achieved in this uh, competition and, and were awarded in the first round of this, and, and each of you have shown a tremendous skill set in science, which I think, you know, when I, when I think of my own high school career, my daughter's uh, experiences in high school, the ability to achieve in science, certainly in mathematics, is, is harder and therefore more prized when you've achieved what you have to this point. And we know that there's still another level of competition. Hopefully uh, you'll all wind up in D.C. as part of the next round uh, of opportunity. But we're still very proud of you. And we also know that whatever the future holds, uh, this is one of those steps where you've been recognized for your accomplishment. So let me introduce uh, Hala Mirza, who is the Vice President of Corporate Communications and Citizenship uh, from Regeneron, and uh, she'll do, I guess, a few introductions, and then we'll invite the students up by school so we can do photo ops. I don't know much about science, but I know a lot about political science, and it isn't a real event if there isn't a photo op. So <laughs> we'll do the photo ops as we go forward. Hala. Well, thank you to the County Executive for hosting this event. Um, and most importantly, congratulations to all of you. Uh, this is an incredible, incredible achievement. Um, and we are so, so proud of you. So I'm not going to take a lot of time, but I just want to tell you a little bit about Regeneron and our history and why, um, why we think programs like the Regeneron Science Talent Search are so important. Regeneron was actually founded 30 years ago this month by physician scientists. In fact, our two founders, um, who we call Len and George, Dr. Len Pfeiffer and Dr. George Yankopoulos, are both previous contestants in this competition. Glenn, our CEO, uh, was semi-finalist, uh, what we call scholars now, and George was the top winner of the competition in 1976. So our joke is that's the reason Len's the CEO and George is the head of science at the company <laughs> because he was the winner, and Len was a lowly scholar, which we know is a quite achievement in its own right. So it gives you a sense of the great achievements that folks in this competition go on to do. When they started the company, it was just them. Um, working out of the building here in Westchester County, and we now have more than 6,000 people, six drugs approved by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. We've helped thousands, some might say millions of people, with really serious life-threatening diseases, and that's just an example of two people <coughs> that participate in this program. So we are so proud of you. We support this program because we think that science is the key to change our world for the better, and we believe that you are the people who are going to do that, and we couldn't be more thrilled to be part of your path. So congratulations to all of you. Um, and we look forward to hearing what you go on to do next. Thank you. I guess we're going to read you out by uh, names of schools. And uh, <clears throat> if I mispronounce your name, I'll apologize up front. Please pronounce it properly for me so that we have it uh, for everyone. And let me introduce our Director of Communications is with us here, Catherine Chaffee, who has organized this for us. Thank you, Catherine. Also with us on her team in communications is Carolyn Fortino. You, Carolyn. you should be aware this is our 16th day in, the, in our administration. Uh, you perhaps know that uh, we started on January 1st, so we're just sort of stumbling our way through, and uh, we appreciate you uh, being with us today. So from uh, Ardsley, I assume these are all high schools. From Ardsley High School, we have Tara Venkatadri and Margaret Zong. Margaret and Tara. we have a backyard school district, one of the ones that I've uh, represented in the past from Blind Brook Schools, Jared Bassett. <laughs> Next we have uh, quite a roster from Byram Hills. We have Alexis Aberman, Alexandra Brocato, Stella Lee, Jeremy Ma, and Kylie Rosalind.
And since I just, before I get too deep into it, Jared, where are you planning to attend college? I'm not sure yet. Not sure yet. Oh, yeah, yeah. Come on, guys. Help me out here. Tara, Tara and Margaret, where are you planning to go? Not sure yet. Not sure yet. <laughs> a lot of options. Everybody knows it's mid-January, right? Okay, good. Two more Very good. Okay, from Dobbs Ferry High School, Rebecca Cadenhead. Rebecca? I have to tell you, there's a group of guys that I meet with for coffee every so often. It happens to be uh, a group of Rye Brook people. And uh, when I meet, and uh, at one point in time, we sit and we talk about, you know, we solve all the problems of the world over coffee on a Saturday morning. One guy goes to Columbia, one guy go went to Penn, one guy went to Columbia, one guy went to Yale. It's very intimidating. And I'm sitting here in a room with people who are saying, I don't know, Harvard, Stanford, I'm not really sure. <laughs> you know. I'm, I'm very impressed. Very impressed. Uh, next, Edgemont. Grace Wang and Michael Winich. <laughs> From the Hackley School, uh, Jasmine Barudi. Barudi. Jasmine? I haven't heard too many party schools out of your uh, choices here, folks. <laughs> Nothing that I expect to see Animal House uh, played. From Harrison High School, another backyard high school for where I live, uh, Chana Kim and Brian Siegel. Hastings, Hastings on Hudson High School, Hannah Scotch. Hannah? Congratulations. And we don't know either, right? No, I do know. Oh, well. Where I was almost all morning this morning. Uh, we have Marina Tosi and Rebecca Marcus. From uh, Ossily, we have Catherine Camp, Emma San Martin, Skylar Jones, and Sarah Hoffman. Kyle can see this as well, but the look on the parents' faces, the smiles, is really fabulous to see. I, I can only tell you that if, that if I had ever gotten a science uh, award, my mother would have been there with a shocked look on her face. Like, I'm sure this is a mistake and it has to be taken back. Finally, from Yorktown, Rory O'Brien. I guess a round of applause for all of your colleagues and friends. <laughs> <laughs>